Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon. Today we're diving into the world of anonymous operating systems. If you're into cybersecurity or just curious about how hackers stay anonymous, this video is for you. Let's get started. First up we've got Tails short for the Amnesiac Incognito Live System. This isn't just any operating system, it's designed with privacy and anonymity at its core. And trust me, this OS lives up to its name. It's like a digital cloak of invisibility. Tails is all about keeping you invisible online, and it does that by running entirely off a USB stick or DVD. This means you can use it on almost any computer without leaving a trace. That's right, you can literally carry your entire operating system in your pocket. Imagine the convenience and security of having your digital world with you wherever you go. Now what makes Tails so special? Why should you consider using it over other operating systems? Well, for starters it's a live operating system. This means it runs directly from the USB or DVD without installing anything on your computer. That means nothing you do on Tails gets saved to your computer's hard drive. Your activities remain ephemeral, vanishing as soon as you shut down. When you shut down, it's like you were never even there. No trace, no history, nothing. No trace, no history, nothing. It's as if your digital footprint is wiped clean every time. But the real magic of Tails lies in its built-in anonymity tools. These tools are designed to keep your online activities private and secure. We're talking about Tor, the king of anonymity networks. Tor is integrated into Tails, providing you with a robust shield against surveillance. If you're not familiar with Tor, it's basically like a maze for your internet traffic bouncing your connection through multiple relays around the world to make it virtually impossible to track. This ensures that your online activities are hidden from prying eyes. And the best part? Tails is incredibly easy to use. Tails is incredibly easy to use. Even if you're a complete beginner to the world of anonymous operating systems, you can get Tails up and running in minutes. Just download the image, flash it to your USB drive, and you're good to go. The process is straightforward and well-documented. Just download the image, flash it to your USB drive, and you're good to go. It's that simple. But Tails isn't just for beginners. It's also a powerful tool for advanced users who need robust privacy features. It comes packed with a suite of privacy-focused apps, including a secure web browser, an encrypted email client, and even an office suite. So you can work on sensitive documents without worrying about prying eyes. These tools are designed to keep your data safe and secure. Now, you might be thinking, this all sounds great, but is Tails really that secure? Can it truly protect me from all threats? And the answer is, for most users, yes. Tails has been audited by security researchers around the world, and it's trusted by journalists, activists, and even government agencies. Tails has been audited by security researchers around the world, and it's trusted by journalists, activists, and even government agencies. This level of trust speaks volumes about its reliability, but like any operating system, Tails isn't perfect. It's important to remember that no system is 100% foolproof. It's important to remember that no system is 100% foolproof. There are always risks, especially if you're being targeted by sophisticated adversaries. If you're being targeted by a nation state with unlimited resources, well, that's a different story. In such cases, even the best tools might not be enough. But for everyday users who want to protect their privacy and anonymity online, Tails is an incredibly powerful tool. It offers a level of security and privacy that is hard to match. It's free, it's open source, and it's easy to use. You really can't ask for much more than that. You really can't ask for much more than that. It's a comprehensive solution for anyone serious about their online privacy. So, if you're looking for a way to browse the web anonymously, bypass censorship, or just keep your online activity private, Tails is definitely worth checking out. It's a tool that empowers you to take control of your digital life. Now, let's move on to our next contender in the world of anonymous operating systems, Wunix. Next up, we have Wonix, and let me tell you, this one takes a slightly different approach to anonymity. See, Wonix isn't about being amnesiac like Tails, it's about creating a virtual fortress around your online activity. How does it do that? Well, Wonix is designed to run inside a virtual machine. Now, if you're not familiar with virtual machines, think of it like this. It's like creating a computer inside your computer. This means that even if your host operating system like Windows or Macos gets compromised, Wunix is still isolated and protected inside its own little virtual world. But the real genius of Wunix lies in its network architecture. It actually uses two virtual machines, one for your applications and one dedicated solely to handling your network traffic. And guess what? 
That network-dedicated virtual machine is permanently routed through the Tor network. That means every single connection you make while using Hunix is automatically anonymized. This separation of the workstation and the network provides an extra layer of security that's hard to beat. Even if an application in your workstation gets compromised, it still can't leak your real IP address or location because all the network traffic is routed through the Tor gateway. Now, Wunix might sound a bit more complex than Tails, and to be fair, it does require a bit more technical know-how to set up. You need to have virtualization software like VirtualBox installed, and you need to configure the virtual machines properly. But trust me, the added security and anonymity are worth the effort. Once you have Wunix up and running, you can browse the web, send emails, and even download files with the peace of mind knowing that your real identity is protected. So, if you're serious about online anonymity, and you're comfortable with a bit of technical setup, Wunix is definitely the way to go. It's like having your own personal anonymity bunker. But hold on, we're not done yet. We still have one more anonymous operating system to explore. Cubes OS. Setting up Wunix might seem daunting at first, but there are plenty of resources and guides available online to help you through the process. From detailed step-by-step -step tutorials to community forums where you can ask questions, you're never alone in your journey to secure your online presence. The Wonix community is active and supportive, always ready to assist newcomers. So don't let the initial complexity deter you. With a bit of patience and effort, you'll find that Wonix is a powerful tool in your arsenal for maintaining privacy and anonymity online. In summary, Wonix offers a robust and secure environment for those who are serious about protecting their online identity. It's a bit more involved than some other options, but the payoff in terms of security and peace of mind is well worth it. Finally, we arrive at Cubes OS. And this one, my friends, is in a league of its own. We're not just talking about anonymity here, we're talking about a whole new approach to operating system security, compartmentalization. Imagine this. Your work documents, your personal emails, your online banking, all these different aspects of your digital life are isolated from each other in their own secure compartments. That's the core concept behind QB's OS. It uses virtualization, much like Wonix, but instead of just two virtual machines, Cubes OS lets you create multiple virtual machines, called Cubes, each dedicated to a specific task or domain. You could have a Cube for work, a Cube for personal browsing, a Cube for online banking, and so on. And the best part? These Cubes are completely isolated from each other, so even if one Cube gets compromised, the malware is contained within that Cube and can't spread to your other Cubes or access your sensitive data in other compartments. It's like having multiple layers of security, each protecting a different part of your digital life. Now I know what you're thinking. This sounds incredibly complex. And honestly, you're not wrong. Cubes OS is not for the faint of heart. It's a powerful operating system designed for users who prioritize security and privacy above all else. We're talking about journalists, activists, security researchers, and even Edward Snowden himself, who famously endorsed Cubes OS. But with that power comes a steeper learning curve. You need to be comfortable with virtualization, command line interfaces, and the overall concept of compartmentalization to truly harness the full potential of Cubes OS. But if you're willing to put in the time and effort, Cubes OS can provide a level of security and anonymity that's unmatched by any other operating system out there. It's a testament to the fact that true security doesn't come from a single feature or technology, but from a well-designed system that prioritizes isolation and compartmentalization. So if you're looking for the absolute best in anonymous operating systems, if you're dealing with ultra-sensitive information, or if you just want to experience the future of operating system security, Cubes OS is the ultimate choice. It's not just about having multiple virtual machines, it's about creating a digital fortress where each part of your life is protected by its own walls. This means that even if one wall is breached, the rest of your fortress remains secure. This level of compartmentalization is what sets Cubes OS apart from other operating systems. It's a proactive approach to security, ensuring that your data and activities are always safeguarded. So, whether you're a professional handling sensitive information or just someone who values their privacy, Cubes OS offers a robust solution that's hard to beat. So, there you have it. The top three anonymous operating systems for hackers and privacy-conscious users alike. We've got Tails, the Amnesiac OS, perfect for beginners, Wunix, the virtual fortress for those who want that extra layer of security, and Cubes OS, the ultimate compartmentalized operating system for the security-obsessed. 
Each of these operating systems offers a unique approach to anonymity and security, and the best choice for you will depend on your individual needs and technical expertise. But no matter which one you choose, remember that true online anonymity is about more than just using the right tools. It's about being aware of your online behavior, practicing good security hygiene, and always staying one step ahead. So there you have it, the top three anonymous operating systems for hackers. Which one do you think is the best? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more awesome content. Stay safe and stay anonymous.